Hi friends! Are you getting the error message, user profile corrupted, while starting your Windows Vista Business Edition PC? Let's go ahead and see how you can troubleshoot the issue. This issue may occur due to a corrupt profile. So you need to create a new profile to resolve the problem. To do so, click on Start and then click on Control Panel. Click on User Accounts. Click User Accounts again to open the Make Changes to User Account window. Click the Manage Another Account option. Click Continue on the User Account Control window. Click the Create a New Account button. Give a name to the new account, choose the account type, and then click on the Create Account button. When the new account is created, close the window. Now to copy files to the new user profile, click on Start and then click on Documents. From the Organize menu, click on Folder and Search Options. Click on the View tab. From the Advanced Settings section, select the checkbox next to Show Hidden Files and Folders option. Clear the Hide Protected Operating System Files checkbox. Click Yes on the warning window and then click on OK. Now locate the old username file that can be located in C colon backslash users backslash old username. Select all of the files and folders in this folder except the ntuser.dat, ntuser.dat.log, ntuser.ini files. From the Edit menu, click on Copy. Now locate the appropriate new username folder. From the Edit menu, click on Paste. Select the Do This For All Current Items checkbox at the bottom of the Confirm Folder Replace dialog box that appears and then click on the Yes button. Wait for the files and folders to be replaced and then close the window. Now click on Start and then click the arrow icon at the bottom right of the pane. Click on Log Off and then log on as the new user. See, that wasn't hard at all. Thanks for watching.